Young world, stop the press. Stop the mother effing press. It says Jeezy files for divorce from wife Jeannie May. It says Jeezy pulling the plug on a marriage that Atlanta rapper filed for divorce on Thursday from the talk show host in Fulton County Superior Court. According to the documents, Jeezy filed in Georgia on Thursday saying their marriage is irretrievably broken, irretrievably, irretrievably broken with no hope for reconciliation. Jeezy is seeking joint legal and physical custody of their one-year-old daughter, Monaco, and he says that they have an existing prenup in place. It says the news could very well be news to Jeannie because she recently celebrated her soon-to-be ex's book and his accomplishments on her heartfelt IG post just a week ago. One week ago. But she put on her IG, she, she said, Today I celebrate a remarkable milestone achieved by my husband, Jeezy, whose memoir, Adversity for Sale, has soared to the New York Times bestseller list. Your story has always been an inspiration to me, but seeing it in print has left me even more in awe of your strength and in all of your strength and wisdom. This is just a week ago she put this on IG, yo. Yo. Your strength and wisdom. You invited us into the most intimate corners of your life where pain and triumph coexist. This moment isn't just a testament to your literally skills, baby, but a recognition of your ability to inspire through the power of storytelling. I know I sound like a goddamn illiterate reading through this stuff because I'm just sitting here like I'm really surprised by this because I uh, hold up. If she ends with I'm endlessly grateful for your voice in this world. Honored to walk beside you, my love. Hashtag New York Times bestseller. Hashtag adversity for sale. God damn. Like I was about to say, I'm actually really surprised by this because the last time I seen them on some talk somewhere, like, uh, uh, like a couple months back or whatever it was, I thought these jokers had it figured out. If there was anybody who, I would thought these were the ones that had this stuff figured out, this marriage stuff. Like, I ain't laughing at it, but I'm just like, damn, this is not what I expected to see. The article uh, continues to say their union was a relatively short-lived affair. The pair got hitched in March 2021 at their Atlanta home in the heart of the pandemic. We reached out, yo, the, <laughs> that's the other thing, man, the pandemic, yo, the pandemic. I mean, for them, obviously, it made them, you know what I'm saying? But the pandemic also broke a lot of jokers, I mean, I could tell you. The pandemic broke a lot of people up. You're sitting around the same person every day, all goddamn day, hearing them breathe, hearing them talk, seeing the way they eat. Every time they touch their face a certain way, you sitting there ready to burst out of your goddamn skin because they bothering you so goddamn much. You're like, what the F is going on? I can't stand this mother. But the pandemic, for them, they got together during the pandemic. You know what I'm saying? But um, this is, this actually to me, like I said, is, 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 surprising news yo i didn't see this coming i thought these jokers here had to figure it out